This is a perfect day to hop on a plane, head down to Florida. Where are we going? Tampa. Yeah, we just got in the rental car, it's 75 degrees out and stunningly beautiful. late but we just got to our campground at uh collier seminole right it's, it's really quick. cute there's palm trees so cute you guys can't see it unfortunately <laughs> look how nice this is best state park bathroom we've ever seen this is classy florida's doing it right I still got that cocaine money down here though. That's what it is. Up before the crack of dawn and we are heading down to the ferry. Look at this, the uh, Black Pearl, Beach Haven, New Jersey. That's right near us. It's crazy, this thing made it all the way down here. American Patriot. So where are we taking the ferry to? Uh, QS. Big Cat Express, look at that thing. Stinky Diesel. We're midway out here, front of the boat keeps diving left and right. And uh, I got a touch motion sickness, but uh, one of the crew, he actually said if you wear an earplug in one ear opposite of your, your primary hand, which I'm right-handed, it's much better. Jen, Jen's feeling great. She said she's only 5% motion sickness, so feels awesome, but can feel a little bit. Almost there. Picture, wait in line here. I don't see a reason for that. Hey, sit down here. So as soon as they move, I'll get, I'll get a photo of you. Is this your beach tire? No, can we go get it though? <laughs> oh, yeah, I would get in that. No nonsense, no hell. Good to go. <laughs> Oh 
Oh, we're making a ride up here, Reynolds. This is where they keep prisoners like you. <laughs> wow, I love the brickwork in here. Incredible. Beautiful. Oh yeah, look at that. What the heck? He signed it. Prickly pear cactus. You can eat that, right? I think so. Angelina house. This must be the shared bathroom right there. Rosie, room number one. We got Rosie, good. room one. Perfect. It's so cozy. Love it. Bigger than our room last night. Heck yeah. It's about a whole 100 square feet. It's a little small, but Maybe it'll do. <laughs> this like is like $370 closet. in Key West gets you. There he is. How's the water? It's warm. Feels like a hot tub in here. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Wow. It's basically a full size jacuzzi. It's like. <laughs> 95 degrees in here, something like that. It's hot. It is amazing. I've never been in a heated pool this hot. Coast Guard, Captain of the Port. Totally water ready. This is where everybody comes for the sunset. Mallory Square Park. Chris found the sticker graveyard. Kind of a shame putting it on this old truck, but I suppose the stickers are what's holding it all together. So let's not cover somebody. There we go, right here. Boom. Right on top of the hog heaven. Doing our Valentine's Day dinner. Mm -hmm. Get my lady some raw bar seafood. They're nothing but the best. Five hundred dollar dinner. It's not. It's like ten ninety nine. <laughs> <laughs> Oh
So how was your stay at the Angelina house? It was really fun. The breakfast was awesome. Breakfast was awesome and we dropped it a five-star review. <laughs> oh, what is it? Is it squishy? Yeah. <laughs> it's like a piece of coral reef or something. <laughs> So many butterflies. There we go, babe. <laughs> that was the best experience. I loved every second of that. She didn't brought the brother fly out with her. Look at that. <laughs> Your family over here? These hospital foremen were similar to nurses of today's hospital. During World War II, Ingham's shipboard complement included a doctor. Oh, they're steep. These are like your basement steps. Yeah, that's true. They're not, they're actually worse. The laundry room. Jen's taking me on a guided tour through the ship. You're coming in the women's room? It's the women's room. Oh, is it? Get out of here. While a Time for relaxation. Galley. Oh, they got a chapel, babe. Whoa. Little mini chapel. Would you like me to go a reading? Now it came to pass in the seventh month that Ismael, the son of Nathaniel, the son of the Priscilla. How's it feel? I don't know, I guess it's cozy. Look, here's the steam turbines. Imagine how loud it was in here when this was working. So cool, I ran this from 1988. 52 years in operation. Wow. It's cafeteria. Does this make you want to join the military at all? I mean, not really. Captain's cabin right here. Oh yeah. It's so cool they let you climb around this whole ship. Imagine they let somebody elderly come on here though and didn't tell them about all the ladders. Oh look, it's got the old school communication for like down to the engine room. So there's no wires or nothing, you speak into that and they speak back to you. Megaphone thing. You alright? Yeah. I'm sure quite a bit. It's uh, steep.
What did you think of the Ingham tour? Uh, it was really cool, a lot of history. World War II, Vietnam. It's cool to see. Back at the Angelina house, grab her bags and go catch this ferry back to mainland. We got John her dozen oysters and now we're gonna hop back on the boat. Pretty cool looking, huh? Yeah, I had no idea. All right. It is a beautiful morning at the Port of the Islands. 80 degrees out. I'm gonna go hopefully find some breakfast. Maybe rent a boat today. I'm trying to sound like I'm in a good mood. We are in a good mood. A little sleepy. Down that little canal that you wanted to see. Yeah, that'd be cool. We ended up taking a ride down to Everglades City. Pretty neat place. Probably, yeah, we're gonna look into a kayak rental now. Doing a small craft advisory today, so not renting them out, but uh, we're gonna take a nice little hike. And this is we're right here, and 10,000 Islands is all, all along here. It's a uh, shallow coastal mangrove community of Everglades National Park. <laughs> what was that? Did you hear that? Someone's rustling around in there. We're gonna buy some lizards. Well, this RV resort's going on the list. We'll have to bring the truck camper there in the future. Look, it's got slips right on the water with your RV there. Freaking awesome. That's if they allow truck campers. It is so windy and beautiful today. Oh, look at the pelican cruising by just doing a nice little beach walk sipping a soda enjoying the nice weather what is it is it like mussels or know, is it rock worms? hard yeah like it's all shells That's mine, I found that. What are you doing? This one's alive. There are so many conks all around here. Or however you say that, conch, conch, I'm not sure. Check out this guy. There he is. Whoop. Sucks back in. We're gonna take a little cruise on the Turner River and double kayak. Let's go. Let's go find some alligators. Such a good paddler. <laughs> You're lucky. They were sinking when I grabbed them. Oh god. He's gone now. What was it? I don't know, he took off though. It's tight. So beautiful, oh my gosh. There's the gate that's about to attack Jen. Jen, you better paddle. How close he is, he could totally snap and get us right here. Gator. Gator. I get the trip of our kayak. Turtle here. Just 
chilling. Don't get too close. Don't get too close. Chris, 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 right. Chris, Chris. Now you know how I felt before. made it to an opening. I believe we could just keep going down this, but probably take a break here and then head on back. I got off to take a leak on this tree and she's leaving me. What am I to do? Like, trying to navigate through this would be insane. Guess I just have to walk back, cross my fingers. Hey, you better come back and pick me up. Do this right into a gator. Beautiful morning in paradise. I'm gonna load up and head north to another campground. Maybe do like a tree obstacle course today. But uh, geez, it's gotta be 75 already. Heading up north 75. Well, there's five courses. What's your confidence level after introduction? Um, not sure. Level one, two, three. It's just the gear. I don't know if I'm gonna remember all that. We are so lucky. Nobody else is here. We're the only ones. We're not rushed. We got lizards all around us and what this is our first obstacle we went through the demo what's your confidence level um it's yeah it's just these carabiners that that i'm worried about but i'm excited to do this all right we'll see how far we make it she just keeps leaving me <laughs> you look great. Pro, oh, babe. No problem. So far, Jen's doing great. We're on course number two, almost done. All right, just go. Yeah. Barely. <laughs> <laughs> Very nice. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> nice, babe. I think that's how that was supposed to go. Yeah. Did you do good? <laughs> Is that a little aggressive on the landing? <laughs> it looked beautiful from here. On the Nearing the end of course five, Jan bailed out at number four. She's actually shooting the video of me right now, I guess. Yeah, it was awesome. Yeah. Good job. You're Drinking good. Pepsi? No, I'm okay. Yeah. Made a quick little stop at the Freedom Factory since we were basically driving by it. Oh, it might be oh. Marshy in there, baby. Oh, it is. <laughs> She's just dead. That's Booyah! Funny. They're not open today, though, but the uh, the speedway or the, the drag strip is. It's the Freedom Factory. The Freedom Factory. Now we're pulling into our campground, the Mayaka River State Park. Mayaka? Mayaka. Did I say it right? Probably. Let's go see the ranger. Let's proceed to the next building. building. Now at the old prairie section. There's 32. Oh, we're right next to the campground host. Oh, bummer. It's not a bummer. I mean, it can be a bummer if they're sticklers. All right, well, this is our site. We're right next to the campground host and a lands camper. Good little setup here. Jen's making the bed. 
probably have to go get some firewood because that's all we got left over from dumpster diving. Truthfully, if you ran up to that guy and tried jumping on him, he, he would just run away though. He would just run away from you. It's like something out of a movie in here. Reminds me of uh, reminds me of Pee Wee Herman movie. I don't know, there was like a jungle scene in the movie. Well, you think of the palm trees as being real stout and uh, strong and upright. Occasionally some had fallen over, fell over, whatever. <laughs> and look at it, it's still surviving, even though it's laying in the dirt. It'll probably never get back up again. Wonder, you know, wonder if it ever will. Why not? But still surviving strong. A canopy walkway and tower community project. Well, let's check it out. I feel like they should have made it a few stories higher because you still can't see over the canopy. Very cool. <laughs> We can go up. Oh, they do go higher, so we can see the top of the canopy. I was gonna say that would have been silly if not. Whew, we made it. 76 feet. Now we are above the canopy of the jungle. Lots of flies up here. Lots of flies, yeah. Why? I don't know. They always go to the highest point, I guess. That's why you you hold your hand up if you're walking around and they go to that. I don't know, but wow. spectacular view. Yeah. Oh, look, it's even got a lightning rod on it. All right, let go. You go first. <laughs> you go. You get the snakes on you. <laughs> what are we doing? We're wait till that goes past the tree line, then make a mad dash for the tower. Ah, oh, missed it. came back and our cooler lid was off. We weren't gone very long and somebody went in, took one of Jen's New York strip steaks. What do you think about this, baby? I'm just shocked that it even happened. I thought that the top blew off. Nope. Some crafty critter came in there. They only took one. They only took one. They left you one. <laughs> and we found the culprit. He is right here. Raccoon. Where you going, buddy? Where'd you go with that steak, huh? Where did you go with that steak? Give me the steak. Can I have a back to Skidoot. Get out of here. Look, we got two of them. Oh boy. They tasted the meat. Armadillo. You cannot see him. All you can see is the eyes. How cool is that? Here, if you want me to Next try morning it. at the Mayaka River campsite, we just cooked breakfast. There's Jen. Gonna hang out for a little bit and then go do something else. This will be our last night here tonight. Pulling up to Crescent Beach and it is foggy. Couldn't find any parking at Crescent Beach, so now we're at Siesta Key Beach. Full parking lot, looks like. And Jen says if she owned one of those houses in Crescent Beach that she would have rented spots in her driveway out. I said, no, you wouldn't, because you wouldn't have to if you owned a spot there. <laughs> it's like pennies for those people. They're Bentleys and Maseratis. Here we are. Seems like a clean place. 
Oh, this is so cool. I can't even see the ocean yet. It's so foggy. Wow. It's a tough day to be a lifeguard. It's hard to spot people swimming out there, huh? Sure. Ooh. A little chilly. A little chilly. I don't know how to Probably like right 60 now. or something, yeah. The water is 65, by the way. 65 degrees Fahrenheit. Will we go out further with me? No. Take it with you. You ready? What is this? These things are awesome. This guy over here, he saw me eat sand. You fell? No, I didn't fall. I just didn't take a very graceful landing. Concrete beach chairs. She was so jealous of my salmon last night that she had to just have some tonight. Or should I say, she just had to have some. He made salmon soup. Look at all that broth he made. Go drink your Pepsi. How's that salmon flurry? Oh, I don't know. And what'd yours come out like? Looks good. Actually, that does look pretty good. <laughs> I put way too much water in mine. It's delicious soup though. Salmon soup. Are you too good to eat out of tinfoil? Yeah. At this moment, yeah. If I don't have to. I mean, I could. I could. I would. She's classy. Classy. Saving up. Microwave dish. Not that classy. So whose salmon was better? I liked mine better. Yours was burnt. No, it wasn't. It was delicious. My salmon was better. Steamed over the fire inside a tinfoil. What are you looking at? Nothing. She says she'll never date me if I don't cut my hair. She's going to leave No, me. no, no. Not cut your hair. What? You have it like all porked up. Oh, right put now. it down. Style it. Go ahead. That's better? <laughs> you like that better? <laughs> oh. Go get him. No, if it wasn't against park rules, I would. You wouldn't. Yes, I would. Look, he's already running from me. He's scared. And this is it. Our final night. Staying at the... Tahitian Inn. Tahitian Inn. Not far from the airport. Very cute little boutique hotel with a bar down there. Maybe we'll go visit the bar in the pool. Jen won't go in the pool, she won't get her hair wet. We're back, 20 yeah. degrees. Back home, and uh, got a snow squall coming through. Snow's gone from when we left, but supposed to get pretty pretty nasty today. Welcome back home. 